up, Amazon viewers? We be reviewing this Sony soundbar over here right behind me. I'm not going to play any music or television through it because Amazon will remove my video or has the ability to do so. That's why we're not going to do that. So let's just talk about the soundbar itself. So I bought this Sony soundbar a few weeks ago, as you can see here. Um, yeah, I bought this a few weeks ago. been using it. It has easily... It's three times louder than my TV. Here's my TV here. It's three times louder than my TV, and we watched V for Vendetta last week in here, and it did, I have a small living room. In this small living room, it truly actually did feel like like cinema quality sound. It was really good. If you have a bigger space, maybe won't be that as impressive, but the sound quality was great. Has been working out really well so far. So I have an old TV. This is a Sony TV as well, but this TV is over a decade old. It still works great, still great. Um, but I will say I had some connectivity issues to the uh, to the soundbar. So I have it connected to my TV through an optic TV cable and an HDMI, as you can see here. Here's the optic TV cable uh, over here, and then here is the HDMI. I have them both connected, and that's what works for me. Um, at first, I had some uh, occasional connectivity issues where just the soundbar wouldn't connect to the TV. It was very strange and be weird. Um, but now I have it synced and everything's going great. So once you find out what works for you, if you have an older TV, it's a little tougher. If you have like a Bravia Sony TV, a newer TV, it should be way easier. They have, it's integrated through an app. Um, so if you have an older TV, might have some connectivity issues, but if not, it's a very high quality soundbar and I would purchase it again. I'm very happy with my purchase.